Welcome to Whoa. our Hello. Let's Concentrate yeah. Cocktail Hour. We are celebrating the launch of our new serum, which I put it on every day. I can't get enough of it. It's so true. Yes. Honestly, he's nearly got Let's through a whole concentrate. bottle. Let's concentrate. And uh, so we That's thought it would be yeah. really fun to create a cocktail around some of the ingredients in this amazing serum, which is full of vitamin C. So obviously, we've looked to our citruses as our starting point. So you ready to make a cocktail? Yeah. So this is called Let's Concentrate. And what we've done, I've laid down a kind of dampened J-cloth. And the reason I do that is I find cocktails can be quite sticky and messy. And it just means you can just scoop up the mess and put it straight in the uh, wash, which is great. So we've got some ice in there yep. to start with. And so it's a very easy cocktail to do. Um, the measurements, um, I find it easiest to use this. So the top one is actually 50 mils, Mark. So we're going to start with... I bought this for her. I did it and I love it. I love all these little devices. So we're going to start with 50 mils of um, gin. Um, looks like we're nearly running out of that. that so, is ruined. Hmm, so I need to put that on the shopping list. So 50 mils of that. Thanks. That's then uh, 30 mils, so less, of elderflower liqueur. Elderflower, I make my own actually. Saint Elderflower. Germain. <laughs> Saint Germain. Saint Germain. Um, it's, it's beautiful. It's quite syrupy and it's quite strong. 50? So 30. 30. So yeah, pretty much do that. And then the next ingredient I love, love, love is called Italicus, which is a bergamot liqueur. We don't grow uh, bergamot in, um, in the UK, um, but it's a very Mediterranean, so 30 mils of that as well. Um, and it's beautiful. It's a very ugly fruit, but oh my gosh, the aroma is so delicious. And uh, I love that hint of uh, kind of Earl Grey tea you get from this fragrance here. Then we are going to add 75 mils of orange juice. So if you like to pop that in there. Next. Actually, just, I've, I've measured it, so you can just pop oh. it straight in. Okay. Okay. And then we have half a juice of lemon. So half a lemon, we just squeeze that. And an egg white. Um, it's about 25 mils. Sometimes you can buy those cartons of egg white um, in the supermarket. So if you're doing that, just pour out about 25 mils, but it's about one egg. So actually, I'm gonna pop a bit of grapefruit bitters in there as well. Probably won't be able to get the top off that. There we go. Just a little dash. It just gives it a little hint of something ooh, quite bitter, and then you've got the sweetness of the liqueur. So that all balances out beautifully. So Lid on. Lid on. Have you ever done that where you've shaken it? I always it? put this on the top because <laughs> kind of I'm goes not a everywhere. professional barman. No, oh, of course you are. Of course mixologist. You are. Now, it needs a really good shape because you want the egg whites to go beautifully fluffy and they just create a lovely surface on the top of the cocktail. So I'll do it like this. Oh, never, wonderful. You can't hear our music. We've got some lovely Mediterranean music in the background. And we've got friends arriving soon, so we thought that would be a nice festive way to kind of start the evening and uh, to celebrate our launch of Let's Concentrate. Perfect. So we now pour these in our cocktail glasses. That is about enough to make um, two. And what you'll see, you've got this lovely kind of frothy, frothy, beautiful, it's a delicate, but kind of punchy cocktail. We really love that one. So that's Let's Concentrate. Now we've also obviously got someone coming who's gonna drive. So I thought it'd be really nice to make um, a cocktail which is called All About The Glow. And All About The Glow is the facial that we're launching at the same time as Let's Concentrate. We have a group of products which are all about glow. So we thought it'd be really nice to do a cocktail based on the ingredients. We've got a carbonated drink in this. I'm actually not going to use the cocktail shaker, but what I do is I just keep these old juice bottles and they make it really easy. So I'm just going to pour in here 200 mils of cranberry juice, and that's nice and sharp. The then, poor old driver. Exactly. And then half as much, so 100 mils of um, orange juice. And then I'm also going to do the juice of half a lime. So if you could do that for me, Mark. We just had our knife sharpened and they are absolutely lethal. So just a 
if you could just squeeze that out and pop that in there. And I'm gonna shake that up so it just blends the ingredients. Then what I have here is some ginger ale. I like Fever Tree just because it's uh, very low in sugar. Um, you could have a sugar-free one. Um, and so if you'd like to just give that a quick shake, Mark. And again, I think this will make probably enough for um, two glasses. Cool, see, drink down, doesn't it? It does. It makes it really nice and fresh. And you can serve that with the ice as well. So if you want to just pour about a half a glass of that, because this will make two glasses. Super. And what I'm going to do is simply top that up with the ginger ale. And that just makes a beautiful, refreshing drink. I'm just going to pop the lime back in there as well. And there you have it. Cocktail out with the warrants. Cheers. 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 Oh my gosh. Fabulous. See you later. See you later.